Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, shouldn't fall ages high with Sean here, but to give you another WWE Mayhem video. And this video, we're doing a second 100 event case opening. We have over 140 cases all together we can open. We have 22 versus cases, and I'm currently working on getting up to 100 of those. And I'm also curious if you guys want me to save up any of these cases. I'm curious if you guys want me to save up for any of these cases. As you can see, I have five premium, five raw cases, and a SmackDown case. If you guys want me to save up for 10 cases of raw, premium, etc., and then do openings of such cases, leave your comments down below. It's going to take a few weeks before I can do that, and obviously I'm going to deny myself two and three star fighters by doing that, but let me know. So, in this video, we will be opening all of the two and three star cases, and I'll leave it up to the community to decide if they want me to do 10 premium, 10 raw, 10 SmackDown, and whatever case is down the road, let me know what you guys want me to do. So we're going to start by opening up the four hour case, which is probably going to be garbage. I actually like getting money out of that. Why do we have $124,000? We've been farming for a couple weeks on that. We're going to open up the daily case, and we'll probably get some two star keys here. We got one star keys, even worse. Alright, so next up, we're going to open up this one-star case because it's basically worthless. Unless we get a character we don't own, which is pretty unlikely. I think Another the only one, one I'm missing superstar. is John Cena, if he's a one-star. We get Xavier Woods, which we already have. Good for 50 two-star keys. Now, one thing that I was really curious about, and I'm not sure why. Why is there a two-star case that's separate from the other ones? Is this a visual glitch or... Is this the reward from the um, versus cases? And let's open it up. So inside this two star case, we receive a duplicate awesome. Samoa Joe. I believe a that is level two superstar. overdrive. Samoa Joe. Yes, it is. All right. So we're not opening that. Now we're going to open up the 100 event cases. And then we'll go to the other two stars and three stars. So let's see if we get anything besides garbage waste. Has anybody been able to tell if these cases have been predetermined or can you actually tap the stop on something? Is there any accurate data on that? Again, the goal here is we want to get some three star keys because that'll land us more three-star fighters. I think we'll open up the two-star cases once we get to about 50. Now, what we really want to get is tier two and three weights. If I can get 12 tier two weights, I can actually upgrade all of the toy fighters to two stars. And I'd love to do that all at once. I believe you can get weights from duplicate fighters, but I'm not 100% sure on that. So far we're getting garbage weights that we don't need at all. Like, I would like to see more basic tier 2 and 3 weights from the versus cases. I believe that's our third hundred keys. I suspect we'll probably get about two 3 star fighters from these, key these keys. And we're still not getting basic weights that we need. A lot of these tier 1, 2, and 3 class weights you can get one a week from the corresponding event. But in my eyes, getting tier one class weights are just absolute garbage. I can't wait until they can actually release a sub button. There's an advanced weight. I will take those. So I'm feeling they're gonna be used in high rank three star fighters or four star fighters. I'm feeling they're gonna actually be used in four star fighters. I don't actually own one. But hopefully we'll be pretty close to one soon. We did get an overdrive on the Undertaker, so we got another 25 or 50 four-star keys. And we almost got Macho Man, but still no tier two or three basic weights. And we're 13 cases in. We do get an advanced weight tier two, so that's not bad. I'm still not sure what they're actually used for, though. 
And we get a two-star Dolph Ziggler. Two-star superstar, Dolph Ziggler. I believe that's level two overdrive as well. And you get tier one weights for a duplicate two-star. I think you get tier two weights on a three-star, but I could be wrong. And the chance of getting a duplicate three-star right now is extremely low. As I only have like 13 or 14 three-stars. I think the Undertaker from the event was my 14th. And how many of you guys have been doing that payback event? Actually get four star keys. Are you guys trying for a hundred? Is anybody actually in the top 50 getting 125 keys? I think it's a really cool event and I really see you know an event like that even once a month being pretty popular because you never know what you're gonna get. So we're 20 aces in, not one tier two weight, not one tier three weight, basic. I really feel that the basic weights need to be a little bit more common and the class weights need to be a little bit rarer. And we get another tier one advanced weight. I don't understand why the advanced weights are more common than the basic. But I'm also doing these 100 event cases just so you can kind of see like the probability of getting weights to uh, two star fighters out of these cases. As you guys remember from the last 100 event case, I ended up pulling every single one of the two stars and I did get the overdrive for Dolph Ziggler. So far we've gotten about five or six of the three star keys. So we should be at three three star characters. We'll probably get to four by the end of this. We got a tier three weight there. I'll take it. Finally, we get a basic weight. Unfortunately, it's tier one, which is absolute garbage. So a lot of events, including versus, give you free basic weights. So, yeah, tier two weights need a higher drop rate. Tier three weights need a higher drop rate. And we get yet another awesome. Dolph Ziggler a that'll be overdrive star, level star, three. Dolph Ziggler. And we get another 50 three star keys. I think it was 50, it could be 100. Either way, we're getting quite a bit of three star keys. I really think the drop rates for three star keys is very fair. And I'm actually not upset getting three star keys because Three-star keys will eventually fuel the four-star characters once you get enough three-star characters, so I'm not upset with that. Granted, you need 20 duplicate three-stars or complete the event, and that'll save you a couple three-star fighters. Getting a lot of keys in the last few pulls. Currently, we are up to three three-star cases for anybody keeping track. Again, we're going to get to 50. And we're going to open up some two-star cases. Actually, we're going to open up all the two-star cases. We get a tier one brawler weight. Absolute garbage, because my Undertaker doesn't need him. At one point, he did to actually get to rank three. More three-star keys. And we get a tier one is vast weight. I would have rather have gotten the tier two or three basic weight. Still at three cases. It'd be kind of cool to see them add in a progressive thing, even if you have more than one case, because there are some people that actually hoard cases just to make videos like myself. And it is kind of cool to see what you get out of it. Kudos to the people that actually watch the entire video. As we get a tier 2 wildcard weight. So we're 40 cases in and we haven't even gotten one tier 2 weight or one tier 3 weight. But we've gotten two garbage tier 1 weights that are just sitting in my loot. Unused. I will not be upgrading the toy characters until I can upgrade all four of them at once. 
And I want to be able to upgrade all four of them to level 20 at the same time. I'm really bummed about this weight drop rate. It's really bad. Still at three cases. If we got as many tier 2 weights as we did 3 star keys, we'd actually be fine. I know we're dangerously close to a 4th case. Really, the tier 2 basic weights need to be as common. There is the 4th 3 star character. So we're 50 cases in, no basic tier 2 weight. That is really stupid. Now in our first 2 star case, we get a Shinsuke Nakamura. That'll be Overdrive level 1. I would really like to get a John Cena. Inside the next one, we get a Goldberg. Awesome. I believe that's Overdrive Level 1 Superstar. for him as well. Goldberg. And we get an Undertaker. Awesome. That is awesome. I'm very happy about that one. That's probably the best pull I've gotten so far, a duplicate Undertaker. Undertaker is probably one of the strongest two-star characters in the game. And we get another awesome. Callisto, which is unfortunate, because that's actually a pretty low-end two-star. Overdrive level three for Callisto. And we're going to save the last two-star case for the very end, just to hype up the three-stars. If we pull a tier 2 weight, I will open up a 3 star case immediately afterwards. So that's what we're going to do. Almost get another Dolph Ziggler. We almost get yet another Dolph Ziggler. I'd still like to know why tier 2 weights are so uncommon, and we get a Macho awesome. Man. A I believe that is star. Overdrive level 2. So far, I've been right with all of my Overdrive, pretty much I actually play this game. Still searching out for a tier 2 or 3 weight. Basic. Getting a lot of keys again. And we get a tier 1 basic weight. almost get a Ric Flair, we almost get a tier 2 weight, but we get another 103 star keys.
And we get another Macho Man. Two-star superstar! Macho Man! That opposes Overdrive level 3. Now, I really want to upgrade some of these two-star fighters, but I really want to get enough weights to upgrade the toys first before I focus on other characters. The only way I would focus on other characters is if my basic weights are going to expire, because I really don't want to waste them. But I really want to get these tier 2 basic weights. Let's see, super rare. A bit too rare. Especially for fixed loot. I think it's as rare as getting a four star character. I think the three star keys are just right, but you really should get the same amount of tier two weights as the uh, three star keys. And the tier three weights should be a little bit more common as well. I know that they want you to be able to struggle getting them, but this is ridiculous. Shouldn't have to get them from tier three duplicates. Alright, so we're 75 cases in, not one single tier 2 basic weight. This is ridiculous. We're probably up to 6 3 star characters now too. Nope, still at 5. Gotta be dangerously close to 6 though. Finally, we get a tier 2 weight. So we're going to open up a 3 star case. It literally took 79 cases to get the tier 2 weight. So as promised, we're going to open up a tier 3 case. Inside we receive a duplicate oh, Undertaker. That a is three awesome. Star superstar Undertaker. I am not upset about that one. And we do get a tier 2 weight, 4 star, 50 fragments. I don't have 300 gold or I would definitely take that case. Now obviously if it sticks around, I don't even think I can get a couple hundred gold by that. But those tier 2 weights are so rare. If it takes 79 to get 1, that's just stupid. You probably have better luck on duplicate 3 star fighters than that. So you just have to grind out the cases, get the three star keys, and get your tier two weights from duplicates. That's probably how it's going to be. I think we had an advanced tier two weight, tier three weight. That's good for the four star fighters. And we get a tier one advanced weight. wild card weight. 15 more cases to go. Another advanced tier one weight. T 
tier one basic weight. Worthless. Nine cases to go and we'll open up the rest of the two and three star characters. Again, I will not be opening the raw, SmackDown, or premium cases until I get ten. Unless you guys want me to just open them up, but I really want to do a ten pack video before I open them up. I could do the same for three star characters if I stop doing versus cases, but or event cases. Another tier one weight, absolutely garbage. So we're down to four versus case, one at tier two weight in 96 cases. Now I don't know if that's intentional considering that three star cases will give you a guaranteed tier two weight. And it's not actually that hard to get three star characters in this game. But I have been overdriving a couple three-star characters. I believe I'm at 150 keys so far. So this is the last versus case. And we get more keys. So now we're going to open up this two-star case. And we do have five more three-star characters to get. We have not gotten a duplicate. Awesome. Okay, Finn Balor. I don't know if I have him. Finn Balor. I do not. So we finally got a brand new two-star character. Now, in the first three-star case, besides the Undertaker, we receive a oh, Cesaro. Baby. I don't believe a I have him. So we have 15 three-star characters now. Undertaker not... Uh, he's in, in this case. We're going to get another Sting. Oh, That's going to be Overdrive a level one for Sting. Superstar. And we get another tier 2 weight. With the 3 star characters, I really don't want duplicates yet. I want to get more actual characters. And we're going to get a 3 star oh, Ultimate Warrior that's 16 star 3 star characters. Star. 393, Warrior. pretty medium of the pack. And we get a 3 oh, star baby. Rick Flair. A 3 star Superstar, Rick Flair. Very happy about that one. And in our final sixth three star case, we get Ron Randy Orton. We get a rock. I'll oh, take baby. it. A three star superstar. The rock. All right. So again, we are saving the premium Raw and SmackDown cases until I get 10 of them. And we're going to get our 50 gold for. 15 three-star superstars. So we got five new characters all together. The brand new characters. Three-star Ultimate Warrior, three-star Ric Flair, three-star The Rock, three-star Cesaro, and two-star Finn Balor. Now, regarding the weights for the toy characters, we actually have the 12 that we need, so we will be ranking up all four toy classes and we'll see how much money we actually need to take them up to rank three so if you like this video on 100 event cases number two in a series as well as getting five new characters three four star or three th four three stars and a two star character please give this video a like rating comment subscribe share this video amongst your friends and as a favorite check out my other wwe mayhem videos playlist Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch, which are all Hollywood Shono. And we need 16 more duplicate three stars in order to open up a four star case, which I hope is not garbage. Leave your comments down below. Let me know who you think I'm going to get first, and have a wonderful day, kids. www.youtube.com slash Hollywood Shono. Subscribe, bitches!